All right, we're getting rolled into our next match here. Little Cholo already in the ring. Well, it's not just any match. It's the main event here tonight. Main event. At Los Little Angeles Cholo. Wrestling. A man I've uh, faced many a times. He has a big opportunity here. He's taking on an international star in Brian Kendrick. Brian Kendrick Spanky, just uh, he's he's an amazing amazing competitor. I've uh, faced him as well on a couple of occasions. Um, legs like tree trunks, and uh, if that guy gets, you know, a solid kick into your head, you could be out just in an instant. Is there any man you haven't faced? Uh, Hulk Hogan. Okay. Yeah. All right. I, I faced Muda. Are you aware of this? I, yes, I I've wrestled Muda. I, I was not there, but I've seen video. Yes. So how about the man coming up right now? An international superstar in Brighton, Kendrick. What show we've had so far culminating in our main event. Happening momentarily. Brian Kendrick. Just just an amazing talent in the ring. This All guy, right. he, he he wakes up and he wins matches. That's how good he is. Well, let's see how he does against a top competitor here in Los Angeles in Little Cholo. Let's get it to Bobby Ramos for the formal introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, this match is scheduled for one fall. And it is your main event of the evening! <laughs> Introducing first, in the corner to the right, from Orange County, California, Little Jolo! Little Cholo just not impressed with Brian Kendrick. I would say that's a uh, uh, felt both ways. Interesting that he might be underestimating an opponent like Brian Kendrick, who is so well versed in international superstar. Uh, both of these men uh, were very well traveled. Oh yes, but you would say Brian Kendrick is the more traveled of the two, obviously. Sportsmanship. Welcome back, Bobby Ramos. Wow, what a show we've had here. Showing the quick speed by Brian Kendrick, Spanky going with that go behind. Cholo quickly turning it into a top wrist lock. Yeah. Trying to get the early advantage here, but Brian Kendrick knows all the tricks of the trade. Spanky going into the, uh, the pressure, quickly turning around on Cholo. I think it's getting, ha it's getting very hard to have the advantage technically wise with Brian Kendrick, a man who is trained under Shawn Michaels and now is actually training for himself here. Here at the main event. Oh, goodness. He gets paid for all his ever so far of the shoulder block by Little Cholo. Little Cholo throwing him quickly to his feet. Thinks he could get uh, the upper hand by uh, keeping uh, Kendrick moving. And the advantage he might have is that he is more of a Little Lucha. Cholo with that quick roll up, look at that. If he keeps it like a Lucha Libre style, he may have the advantage because that's more of his base as opposed to Brian Kendrick. But so far, Kendrick keeping up with him every step of the way here. That sweep into a beautiful roll-up. Cholo just putting in the work right now. Yes. <laughs> Futurely, uh, in the stand-up, you don't see the opponent roll out of the ring to save him. Spanky quickly taking his, his way out. He needs a quick breather. Getting those head, those hands above his head, getting some air in, getting yep. them in those lungs. See, that's when you know uh, you've been uh, worked over quite a bit. Just, just Spanky is just not able to keep up with uh, uh, Cholo at this point. Well, well that's where his Lucha Libre might come to an advantage here. Cholo is Lucha Libre background. He has wrestled Lucha Libre all over this nation and in other countries as well. Yeah, it's just, it's uh, another thing of. Uh, you know, looks can be deceiving there. Cholo, Cholo has a bit of a weight advantage on Brian Kendrick, to be polite, but uh, he's just, like you said, he's, he's been around this world doing Lucha Libre, and so he's just that quick. Oh. He's that quick. Oh. Oh. Shots yeah. By Cholo taking it to the streets right now. Taking it to the streets. Michael hey, McDonald. Well, but 
Meanwhile, going over the top. Quick as a hiccup. Look at that bridge. Whoa. Wow. He is he is not Mrs. Step Cholo. Cholo definitely has something to prove here. Look at him with that cradle too. His fingers were locked. I don't yeah. know how Kendrick. That was got a beautiful that. bridge. You just saw it coming over the top. Ah! You would think that Brian ah! Kendrick being the international ah! star that he is would have the advantage in this match, but Lil Cholo has something to prove here. Hey Kendrick showing the uh, the quick equalizer, the quick choke. Always a good equalizer. Oh. Sometimes oh. sometimes uh, Kendrick's gotta choke a bit. Whoa! Referee Justin Borden, never watch out. Oh no. Oh, was he going for a schoolboy? Was he going for the groin? We'll never know. I think uh, I look like the groin. I think the schoolboy was trying to reach for his peanuts and uh, I found think a banana. It was, it was clearly an accident. Clearly. Clear. Yeah. Maybe, maybe an accident. We're gonna go ahead and go with maybe an accident. Maybe an accident. Schoolboy nuts. I've, I've I've wrestled him enough times to so look like the form was going for the schoolboy. Nuts. Maybe maybe caught the guys and you know this this is the situation. Nuts. Oh god. Oh. But uh, who's to say he's not going to take advantage of the situation? Well, you know? he just did with that kick to his ample midsection. Did you just say it's ample? Yes. His ample midsection there. Come on. What? Oh, kick it there, trying to pressure on the uh, throat of little Joe. Tell you, go back to your battle. Is that what he said? I didn't hear him say it. Well, I heard him the Empire, so I assume that's how all like oh, okay. Meadows talk to, you know, right. gangsters. Justin, uh, Justin, keeping a... Uh, Tight hold on this match, not like the last ref, and just lost control, no control whatsoever. Well, that was a hard match to contain. This one, though, looks like it's starting to break down a little bit itself. With the shots. Going back and forth. You're not getting a full advantage here. Uh oh, Cholo coming back down. Oh. Spanky taking quick advantage of that. He got a almost got him with a short. Cholo's oh, hopes up, going for a chop exchange and uh, slipped him the knee. Cholo so quick on his feet was able to pull him out of the ring. Might be going for a cross body. And that is thinking on your feet. He's crafty. He don't have a seat. I think uh, referee Justin's gonna let that slide. He knows this is the main event. We don't want a, a DQ on the main event on the show. Sitting in the chair. Or his rear. Or his rear, if you get land on, on his rear the way it was thrown at him, you get counted by trying to land on his rear on the seat. That didn't happen, and now he's. You need the to stop drinking. Wait, ever? No, but you need to stop. It's the main event. It's a little too late there. Yeah, it's always. I'm going to go ahead. Yeah, you're correct. There's, there's not going to be any arm drags for the rest of this match. <laughs> Oh, Spanky clearing house, throwing little Cholo right through the crowd. Not quite the splash zone, though. I can't see from afar. Are they hot? I can't tell. I got stitching over my eyes. Well, you got those adios Monday through Friday goggles on. Yeah, and the stitching over the eyes on my mask, so it makes things a little difficult to begin with. You wearing a mask? Well, yes, I wear You got a, a double leg hook. Spanky quick double leg. Cholo able to get out of it. Oh, you see men walking out here every day by Ramos who wear a mask with horns on it? No, but I see men every day applying a paddle crutch, much like right now. Oh, no. Using likely Bobby Ramos. Oh, this is a bad neighborhood. Come on, Cholo. Come on. Oh, oh. I know how that is. Kendrick with some quick uh, cross faces. Just punishing oh. Cholo. But punishing him. him. With the form as well to the face. That, that's the cross face. That's what I'm speaking of. You need to stop. Stop drinking. He's blunt, but he's got a point. He said no! Come on, Come on, Come on. intoxication is the way to go. The ref checking the choke, making sure everything's legal. It must be because referee Justin. I think Cholo's tapping out. I think it's over. I don't know. But Justin did a fine job this evening, and he's saying no. Cholo coming back with the floor to the midsection. Oh. Both these men have been striking each other hard this evening. Cholo just fighting his way to his feet. I uh, think Cholo has the band if it comes out from the street fight. Ever so slight. He looks out on his feet, to be honest with you. Yeah. And those forms. Cholo just, just finding the rope to keep himself on his feet. Spanky with a quick jawbreaker. Temporary advantage, he's... But 
Cholo is still on his feet, even if he is in the rugs. Oh, quick duck and over Cholo goal. pulling the rug out from Kendrick. Kendrick flying right out of the ring, almost into the crowd. Good job to add on the plans, but hey, here comes Cholo. Have you yes. seen a Cholo fly? You want it? Yeah, I did. Oh! oh. He wears his case Swiss to drop kick. For Flying us. burrito. Flying burrito. I had one of those. Delicious. Lolitas, San Diego. Wow. Nowhere else to find him. Can we go after this? Yeah. Okay, good. I want some carny fries. I want I want carne asada fries right now. After seeing Cholo's flying burrito, I want a carne asada. Oh. Carne asada fries. Insane. Hopefully you guys get some money from, from that place for your plugs. There's from there's no while. need. Money rains in that place. It's so good. Alright. Back to Taro, you're taking this. Come on. You need to focus. No, you need to focus here. You're distracting us. I can't even see the action. It's getting so hot and heavy. We got a war zone over there. Is there one so tell what's going on? I only see fist flying. Cholo and a cloud well, of dust. He just punched him in the mush and uh, is Little now Cholo's rolling him back into the ring. Rolling Kendrick back in. Kendrick, just aware of his, his surroundings, kicks Cholo off to slow well, him down like a bit. Get some separation. Power snap, power slap. Two and a half. We got two and a half. But obviously, that's not quite enough. Both men just look out on their feet. Oh, All Justin. right, that's this is too much. Referee clearly cheating. At the Y. There's some bias going on in this match. He didn't know what to do with that foot, so he just held it. Sold him a fried peanut butter and banana sandwich in the back. I mean, that's oh. the kind of payment I could see referee Justin. Oh come on, Bobby Ramos. Kind of. Justin Bourne is a fine official here at Los Angeles Wrestling Bobby Ramos. And a well-fed one at that. But Cholo going to the top. Missed the foot stop. Roll slow. Oh, I thought he was getting a clothesline. Counters all the way around. Played by Kendrick. Kendrick really scores a three count. And that shows you how well-traveled Kendrick is. He's a seasoned vet. How deep that hook was. He's putting all of Cholo's weight on his shoulders. Barely able to kick out of that. But yeah, still will able to get that three. I think Kendrick has to go for it all here. He needs to get that sliced bread. Indeed, you talk about season, put some pepper on this sliced bread number two. That's right. Here we go. Oh, here we right. go. He's, he's going, going right for Cholo able to push him off. Eat some turnbuckle. Oh, uh-oh, what's this? Oh my goodness. DVD, that's DVD, really yeah. out of his wheelhouse. Almost gets it. Is that three? No. Nope. Rupert Johnson is saying it's a two count. Or he could be giving us the British middle finger. That's that's something that uh, Cholo didn't prepare for. Uh, that's not one of uh, Kendrick's normal moves, the DVD, as far as I know. Well, that tells you the expertise and the experience of Brian Kendrick coming to his advantage in this contest. Plus, it's always good to have an extra one in the pocket, you know, something you bring out on special occasions. Yeah, and Los Angeles Wrestling Grass already got a special occasion for any wrestler competing. Spanky setting him up there in the corner. Comes. Slice Electric bread. Cholo able to stay on his feet, eat some turnbuckle. Oh, and here we go. Leg Larry out of nowhere. Quick as a hiccup. Did you see that? Kendrick was on his ass. And just, just oh, like that. Leg Larry, brain buster. Pushing, that might do it. pushing him over. One, two. There is nothing else Kendrick could have done wow. on that. He had him so close to the ropes, he made sure Cholo didn't grab the rope, hooked his hand up, had both of his legs. Cholo just kicks out of that. But Cholo somehow escaped out the back door there. He's still in this. The fans are behind him. The room for the local boy. You know, sure, Brian Kendrick is living on Los Angeles now, but he didn't grow up. He's, uh, stretching out Cholo, yeah. trying to resemble a lowrider bike. Looks like a, a, a full Nelson clutch. He's got a yeah, dragon was, clutch on. That spins that it. Is. Oh. Regardless, it's a very effective maneuver here. Cholo eating canvas. Gosh. He might be to scoot him away from those is he going, uh, he is he going for cattle mutilation? Not quite from that position. Over. Because he's not to flip over if he has the arms uh, locked. Well known fact, uh, uh, Kendrick trains with uh, American Dragon. Yes. Brian Danielson, who uh, utilizes that, uh, that cattle mutilation. I wonder if... If he flipped over, he would have it, but he's losing it. As Cholo's getting onto his feet. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. Kind of I a shoulder drag. Okay. Well, you go take your 
shots. Oh! oh. Up kick. And I think a young woman just lost her voice. And screaming her support for Lil Cholo. Brian Campbell trying to find the rest of his face before continuing this match. God, it might be in the splash zone here. Cholo's got to take advantage of this. Oh, and he obviously does. If he can get that cover here, he might get a quick one, two, three count. Let's see. Here he goes. Oh. Well, Kendrick is double tough. Let's say, you notice his shoulder didn't even like go all the way up. He barely twitched it, was a, it, was it out. A body flail, if anything. That was enough, though, to stop that one, two, three count. Cholo cleaning his neck and dropping it in the middle of the ring. That can mean only one thing. He's going for the victory, the finish. He's got to here, because that's going to be one of the biggest victories in his career if he beats Brian Kendrick here. Oh, backslide by Kendrick. This will do it. Oh, almost stole a victory there. Oh. Shades of his trainer. Size break number two. Oh. He pulls it up. That's it. One, two. Oh. Are you kidding what? me? Are you kidding me? I cannot believe I just that. That slice, slice bread, not just cutting it. It's. It wasn't enough. That's insane. The fans gave by the man who grew up on the streets of the OC. Go Cholo. That, that. I'm sorry. That little Orange hiccup. County. That little hiccup on the step up, I don't, I don't know if uh, that was enough for, for Cholo to just kind of get his bases about him, embrace himself or what. He was able to kick out a slice bread and that's really unheard I, I of. I still can't believe he got out of that. Kendrick put him on the top, what's he going for? Who knows at this point, Brian Kendrick might be getting desperate here to get Loving the victory. Loving form. But Cholo, I don't know how Cholo can still be in this. Kendrick's got to say I don't know and He's obviously going for. He's going for the Sometimes ultimate slice bread. Oh, he's going yes. for the whole he's loaf. Bread. I, I would say it's. Toasted. He's going. He's, he's going, going for, the, for loaf. the whole loaf. He's going for the whole loaf. Didn't quite work out quite there, but he still has him up there in a very precarious position here. Oh boy. Oh, but. Going for that uh, side walking. side belly to back off oh, of the top. Uh, <laughs> Whoever gets the worst of this could be the loser of this match. Oh, and a cutter! Wow. Cut Second top. row cutter. He got it! Wow. Unbelievable. Here is your winner, I'm gonna go ahead and call that an upset if I've ever seen one. Absolutely. Kendrick is just a seasoned veteran, as is Cholo, but uh, you just, you just, you go into this match and you look, you know, you stack the chips, and, and, and who does he play in favor? Absolutely. And for Cholo to pull this off, it's just amazing. Yeah, he pulled off that middle rope cutter out of nowhere. You get the quick one, two, three, and Lil Cholo's pulled off an upset by Viva George in the main event over. International Superstar by Kendrick. Once again, our main event. And what a show we had here at Los Angeles Wrestling League. I want to thank Scott Moss, he's our guest commentator. And it's, it's been a hell of a treat just to come in here and uh, you know sit next to you guys and call these matches. Spanky showing that he he in fact respects Cholo and what's what's uh, taking place between well, these two, on, two uh, competitors tonight. Sorry to interrupt you, Scott, but let's see. Sorry, mutual respect here. Let's see. All right. You see out of the house, Mike, did you? Why didn't you? Well, there's no barbershop window nearby, so I don't see anything bad happening. Well, that's a good thing, because these two men are now at their respect. And wow, what a night of exciting action we've had here at Bobby Ramos. On behalf of Scott Moss, Bobby Ramos, this is Taro. Signing off at another exciting edition of Los Angeles Wrestle League here at the Poppy Banana Dome in Huntington Park, California. Peace.
be sure to look for us. Google, go to YouTube, go on Facebook, and look at Los Angeles Wrestling League to find more videos, find all the news on more exciting action here at Los Angeles Wrestling League.